I'm Julia Zabo, also known as Pet Reporter, and I am the Living with Dogs columnist for Dogster.com. I've actually written six books, and I'm hard at work on my next one. It will be about dogs. That's as much as I can say right now. <laughs> I love dogs, and I think nobody's life is complete without one. So I'm here to tell you about a variety of different dog breeds that might suit your lifestyle. I hope you'll adopt one soon. The Rottweiler is an amazing dog, and actually, if you want to be really technical, because it is a German breed, you, the W is pronounced as a V, like Victor, so it's Rottweiler. There is actually a statue in Rottweil, Germany, of a Rottweiler, a beautiful dog. Um, these dogs were originally used as working dogs, and they still are used as working dogs, but this is a great example of a dog whose job has evolved to meet, you know, and match what humans need. In the old days, the Rottweiler was actually used as a drover. They actually drove cattle and other livestock to, um, for, for the people who were butchering them. They also accompanied butchers to market and they, the money was often tied around their neck uh, because who's gonna mess with a Rottweiler? But in reality, they're actually very cuddly, wonderful dogs. The Rottweiler now works in search and rescue. They do therapy work. They are service dogs also because they're very strong. They pull things. Um, you know, they're, they're just amazing all around strong working dogs and they like to have a job. Similar to a pit bull, a Rottweiler really does need a strong hand, a strong but gentle hand uh, in training. That's very important for a dog like a Rottweiler so that he or she doesn't become aggressive. So I've gotten to know many of them. I love this breed. They make wonderful dogs and um, I, I think they're beautiful. Just the, the black glossy coat with the brown markings. They often have little eyebrows and sometimes when you see mutts um, with eyebrows it's pretty, pretty easy to figure out that there's some Rottweiler in the lineage.